Hi guys, how are you doing today? So today I thought I'd read from you to you guys from outside. Um, it's so nice out here today. It's sunny, there's a little breeze going on. So I thought it'd be fun to come outside, get some fresh air, and read you a story. So today we're gonna read, I turned my mom into a unicorn. And this is by Brenda Lee. <clears throat> Do you think you could turn your mom into a unicorn? What would you name your mom if she turned into a unicorn? So let's see. Once upon a time, there was a giraffe and his name was Ted. So there's Ted. What kind of animal was he? That's right, he was a giraffe. Ted's mom was always mad in the morning. Put on your underpants. Does Ted look like he wants to put on his underpants? <clears throat> She's always grumpy in the afternoon. Why do you think she's grumpy? What does Ted have all over the floor? <clears throat> she says, pick up your toys. She's also very grumpy at night. Go to sleep. Mom is always grumpy, Ted thought to himself. I wish she would turn into a happy unicorn. <clears throat> As he wished upon a star, he fell asleep. The next morning, a rainbow sparkled across the sky. Ted went into the kitchen and his wish came true. His mom turned into a what? A unicorn, you're right. Yay, Ted said, look, he's saying yay. <clears throat> right away, they played together. The unicorn showed Ted how to make rainbows and gold coins. How is he making rainbows and gold coins? He was quite stinky. Whoa. They ate their favorite food. What kind of food are they eating? What kind of food do you see? Do you see any healthy food that they're eating? I don't either. And they acted silly together. Blah, blah, blah. Oh no, they even made a bigger mess together. It was their happiest day ever. But soon it was bedtime. <clears throat> Ted looked at his empty bedroom, and Mommy was not there. Hmm, what do you think Ted's thinking? He missed her yummy pancakes. And he missed her at the park. He missed her bedtime stories and missed her bedtime kisses. Did your mom give you a kiss goodnight? Well, I want my mom back. Then something magical happened. What do you think's happening? What's happening to the unicorn? came back. <clears throat> Ted jumped with joy. He gave his mom a big hug and said, I'm so sorry, Mommy. I will never turn you into a unicorn again. Then the next morning, uh-oh, what do you think's going to happen? 
Ted put on his pajama pants and picked up his toys. Mommy gave him a present for being such a good boy. He opened the present. A unicorn doll, he yelled. He was super happy. Thank you, Mommy, he whispered. I love it, and I love you even more. Always be thankful for what you have. Do you think Ted's thankful for his mommy? He looks like it, huh? The end. <clears throat> now on this part of the book, it's saying, how many pizzas are on this page? Can you count how many pizzas are on this page? Go ahead and look and then we'll count together. Okay, did you count them? Let's count together. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And how many pink donuts can you find? How many is there? Can you count? I think I see a lot of them. Let's count them together. <clears throat> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Twelve pink donuts. How many blue donuts do you see? Let's count together. One, two, three, Four. And this page says, oops, how many rainbows can you find? Can you count the rainbows? Let's count together. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, Nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Twelve rainbows. And then how about the stars? How many stars can you find? Let's count them. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Good job counting, guys. That was the end of the book. Go ahead and kiss your brain. We'll see you again later. Bye.